What's up, y'all? This is Desmond, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to edit color palettes for characters in King of Fighters 2002 Unlimited Match on Steam for PC. Before we get into that, just want to let y'all know that uh, I stream KOF content every Wednesday at 6 p.m. Central Time, 7 p.m. Eastern on Twitch. So feel free to check me out, chat with me, ask me questions, play with me online. Um, have a lot of fun, so be sure to check me out. And also, um, when you finish watching this video, give it a like, um, subscribe, and comment if you have any questions. And also check out DreamCouncil.com. It is a SNKFGC website web page for those uh, players that are living in North America and beyond. We have a wiki. We have um, updates on on different um, SNK news, uh, community wise, and stuff like that and game guides and how to play KOF. So be sure to check it out. So one of my favorite things I noticed when playing King of Fighters uh, 2002 UM on PS2 was that there was a color edit mode. Unfortunately, when the game was ported on the Steam, the color edit mode was absent from that version. Fortunately, now you can actually edit the color palettes thanks to a mod that has been created that supports other games as well but there is a mod where you can color edit all the characters in the game and it is called um, pal mod and I'm on the website right now and I have it opened up uh, as well but it's called pal mod I found out about it through the King of Fighters 2002 UM uh, discord uh, server I'll put the link in the description section and there's more instructions on how to uh, get it up and running and how to um, you know be able to start editing uh, characters in the game and there's a channel where there's you know people sharing their colors and then the developer is here too he's also you know providing updates and asking questions so be sure to check that out I'll link that to you in the description section but um, but right now, I'm going to just show you guys basically kind of how I do it. And I have this uh, window open to where you find the ROM. And I believe um, this file has the uh, characters um, palettes information. So you find that in this directory right here. And you click on it right here. Make sure it's the correct one, not this one. But make sure it's this one. You open it up. And right here, you see the palette right here, the sprite with the color palettes over here. And this is Andy. And I edited his, um, when you press A, light punch, that's the version um, of uh, color that it is. And there's B. You know, if, if you play the game, you kind of know these colors. The only thing that's kind of unfortunate is that you can't revert back to the original color that you had. I believe that you have to like basically start from scratch and, and kind of reinstall um, the, the files of the game to a certain degree to bring it all back. And um, oh, also, uh, there is an extra kind of uh, menu right here. So you can also edit the different shadings for uh, certain uh, I would say um, things that the character may have like for example this is like when you go into max you press uh, BC and this is how it looks and you can change that color he can change this color how he looks during his um, HSDM and soul pal uh, I think yeah I think that's from when um, a certain character can uh, do a certain move that uh, saps your life away or something like that. But yeah, you can mess with these too. And I'm going to show you a one that I did of uh, Iori. This is one that I did. And uh, this is Kuzanagi. Um, I'm going to start on him pretty soon. But I just want to show you all real quick on how to kind of um, get started on doing one. Why don't we do Melee? And why don't we pick not D not C which ones I don't like the least I don't care for hmm. 
you know what why don't we mess with D and we're just gonna just mess with a few colors so up here here are your uh, your color swatches and you can move the colors up and down slide them up and down which is pretty cool slide this part up and down if you want a kind of a different color and this is more for like the intensity and brightness and then we got the blue area right here so it's green blue red and you can also switch it up this way using uh, HSL if you like and let's see why don't we turn the red down a little bit let's see if we can kind of give her a, a different color pants oh wow that doesn't look too good and oh okay this this looks kind of kind of coolish why don't we mess with the shirt so let's mess with the dark gray which is like the kind of like inside shading a little bit okay this will kind of give her a little bit of a greenish color over here and we can also brighten up a little bit more of her hair with the gloves and I think why don't we also see if we can change the darker shade of the shirt and some more areas around her and you can also change uh, the skin color as well if you choose so let's see I think that changes things a little bit let's try a different one oh yeah this this changed things quite a bit oh wow so yeah if you want to make her darker or lighter you, you surely can and this is another shade right here so I, I, I think I'm gonna just keep things how they are right here just as an example so what you do if um, you want to save it is uh, you go to update you hit update and then you go to file and you go to patch changes and it'll say right here files patch successfully zero errors now we're gonna open the game up and you got to do this every time when you edit with this program you got to open the game up load it up and then see how it turns out so we're going to open the game up let's go to practice mode and let's choose which color which which one which button was that again let me look d so we're going to hit heavy kick hopefully that'll be it and there's our color look that's pretty cool that is really really cool so definitely try this out again visit discord server to check out the instructions on how to get started for you can also view messages from the developer of this mod and for you can also see other players color edits as well and also I believe there is a way that you can even easily swap and trade color edits without even like messing with the colors you can probably move a file and place it somewhere within um, this mods directory just go ahead and read everything or as much as you can in that um, channel of that discord server for more information and play around with it it's a lot of fun so I think that's about it thank you all so much for watching I really really appreciate it so much be sure to give this video a like, be sure to subscribe, and be sure to comment um, with uh, any questions or, or um, comments or, or, or anything like that, any feedback. And even if you want, I would even um, be open to you sharing your own color mods as well. Let me see what you can come up with and share them with other people. And also, I stream every Wednesday at 6 p.m. Central Time, stream KOF games, this game, 98 UMFE, King of Fighters 11, etc., etc. And we just have a lot of fun. It's very informative, very uh, entertaining. Um, you know, and I chat with you know different people in the KOF community and play um, with them as well. Be sure to check that out on Twitch. 
all information will be in the description section below. But that's about it. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm out here. See y'all later. Peace.